guys and gals, welcome back to another Vinnie Vip Productions video. I am Vinnie, your host, also known as BNSF 6951. This is a model railroad channel. So if you guys are interested in run up sessions, scratch builds, live streams, prototypes, and everything related to model railroads, this is the channel for you. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down there. <laughs> Hit the bell or up there and give me those too. Anyhow, with all that being said, let's get on with the video, so come on in. This Vinny V production brought to you by Yankee Dabbler. For all your model railroad needs, check out Yankee Dabbler. Don't forget, 7% discount with BNSF 6951. And by Highways and Byways, awesome street graphics for your roads and streets on your model railroad layout. If you guys are looking for sophisticated model railroad electronics, Logic Rail Technology has what you need. For a 5% discount on certain items, use code BNSF6951. Alright guys, now it's time for the next step on your layout. Trees! I have been dealing with Bob for 7 years now and he does excellent work on his trees. So if you need some trees on your layout, check out Long Shadow's Trees. Tell them the cuz sent you. Hey guys and gals, check this out. These are my two new SD40s with the decoders in them. And uh, now they also have been addressed to their cab numbers. Now in normal videos, this is the red end of the line right here, which would be Ash Fork. But check this out. We are getting closer. Yes, we are. So watch what happens when we go around this curve. Now, unfortunately, that little hopper car that I'm using as the buffer car was giving me unwanted uncouplings. But anyhow, check this out. We are going into upper level number three. Oops, sorry. Excuse the shaky camera, but uh, it's hard to run the train and do the camera at the same time. Uh, there's my tank car with the Fred on it. And now, this is only with the scenery partially done. Imagine what it's going to look like when all the scenery gets done. So, I think the first uncoupling is right around this curve. I might have cut it out. I don't remember if I did or not. But anyhow, it will uncouple somewhere along the line here. Sorry for being out of screen right there. But I think this is going to be the first uncoupling. Yeah, maybe not. Or maybe it's the first. Oh, there you go. There's the one uncoupling. Uh, I don't think that hopper likes to play nice with the rest of the train. So we'll have to see what's wrong with that guy. But anyhow, yeah, there are a couple more derailed uh, uncouplings. You're going to stop that train there, Vinny? You lost your train. Come on back. Yo. No. <laughs> I guess I should have cut that out. <laughs> Anyhow, here we are picking up the train again. And uh, we're going to cruise on down and see how far we can get without another uncoupling. Anyhow, I am really, really excited about this. As you guys can see, a lot more plastering has been done. Uh... And we're going to lose this. Uh, we're going to lose the train here, I think, again. Let's see if I'm correct. Uh, maybe it's around the other side of the curve. But just imagine a big, huge mountain right there. The train will be hitting halfway around. Then it'll appear on the other side. Now watch. Watch this. Bada bing. <laughs> Another unwanted coupling. Yes, sorry, Bob. Gotta love it, man. <laughs> Anyhow, I was having fun with this. And now uh, today, I think I'm going to go ahead and hook up the rest of it and make the entire loop and see if it actually works the way it's supposed to. Anyhow, this is going to be the last part of this run because um, I didn't go much further than this because the track still needs to get clean. Thing I hope you guys and gals enjoyed this video. And as always, your questions, comments, inputs, subs, shares, and likes are always welcome. DNSF 6951 out.